Man, that got real funky out of nowhere. <laughs> Hi, chat. I'm gonna turn it down a touch. Hopefully that's better. Hello, hello. Happy Friday part two. Uh, let's see, Luna. Congrats on first this evening. Hope you're doing well. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Uh, welcome in, Samurai. Welcome in, Eddie. Welcome in, Hug. Welcome back, Hug. Uh, let's see. Uh, new day. Thank you so much for the 15th stream watch streak. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're all having a wonderful day. Um, I just had dinner. I made barbecue chicken with like red bell pepper and red onion and I put pineapple in mine. It was really good. Though I uh, apparently tried to make soup. It, I almost needed a bowl for my barbecue chicken. Uh, I don't know what went wrong, but something went wrong there. Um, besides from that, it was really good and I made homemade mac and cheese and... Um, can you repeat that? I was in ads. Oh, I was just telling chat how I made uh, barbecue chicken and it was very soupy, very liquid. I almost needed a bowl and then I made homemade mac and cheese and green beans. It was yummy. It was very yummy. <laughs> Uh, welcome in Slavino! Also, Akabu, thank you so much! Thank you, thank you! Welcome in Robobot as well! But I'm sure you didn't have any strawberry? No strawberry! No, 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 no strawberry! I do have an orange with me! <laughs> Two years, what the heck, right? That's how I feel! The barbecue that you can drink? Yeah, you could have absolutely put it in a cup and drank it. I actually put a little bit of water because we had finished the, the barbecue sauce. I put a little bit of water in there and I, I shook it a little bit and I put it on my dog's food. So they got some barbecue food too. <laughs> also, Howling, like, welcome in, welcome in. Also, thank you again for the uh, ram. Thank you, thank you. It actually came in today. Uh, I was talking about it in the Discord. It took, it took them less I don't know exactly when they they put it at my doorstep, but it took them no more than 16 hours to ship the ram. It went from, hey, your item has shipped to it being on my doorstep in at most 16 hours. Because I got the email that it shipped last night, like at 11 o'clock, and then I checked the mail. Uh, right after I left stream, and it was there, on the porch. It was crazy. So, uh, maybe this weekend I can put in the RAM, download more RAM, and, uh, pewter can go even faster. Especially if I also, um, have it set, set the RAM at the right speed. So, we'll see about that. Uh, I say I. Hudo's gonna be the one to do it, of course. Cause he's, he's the really smart one, especially with computers. Um, but yeah, hopefully we'll get the, the pewter all, all situated this weekend. Was it homemade barbecue sauce? No, no, no. It was uh, store-bought barbecue sauce. I don't even remember the brand. Welcome in, Tilo. Good to see you. Hello, hello. But yeah, I changed the uh, startup music for... Be careful feeding the doggos. Oh. Oh? Why is that hug? I've never... I've never heard of that. Sugar bad for doggos? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They really like it, though. I know my... My husky, she is, uh... My husky. I said that so... So slithered. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. My husky. <laughs> Yeehaw, my husky. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Um, my husky... She is a sugar fiend. She got a gummy one time. Now, anytime we have gummies in the house, she will pester you and pester you and pester you. And she gets so excited if she ever gets one. She's like, oh my goodness. She has quite the sweet tooth. Barbecue sauce often has lots of sugar. 
I could see that, yeah. It's usually really sweet. Oh, welcome in Zapparo! Uh, setting up the right speed is luckily trivial, like two clicks and done. Uh, I know it's pretty easy, but I still don't know how to do it, so... I, I leave the uh, computer stuff to you, though. Hello, Subna! Welcome and welcome in! I hope you're having a wonderful day! Uh, I hope you guys liked the music, the start music for today. It's the... It's the playlist for the game we're about to play! The Duck Detective. Here's, here's the link if any of you wanted to listen to it off stream. I, I've, I've been really enjoying it. I really like the vibes, especially that one that we came in on. That was very, uh... Very jazzy. Very jazzy. Very, uh... Just came out of nowhere. Um, but yeah, we're gonna play some Duck Detective. Hopefully we find out what happened to the, the secret salami. Um, maybe we can eventually get back together with our wife and after kicking our, uh, bread addiction. We'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Mental exhaust. I'm sorry to hear that. I hope your weekend. I hope you're able to recover um, this weekend. The husky haunting in cinemas near you. <laughs> Hello, RV. Welcome in. Welcome in. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Hope you've been having a wonderful day. All right. Let's switch over. Oh, thank you so much, Alphamod. Thank you. Thank you. All right. Let's switch over, chat. Wah. All right, I'm gonna turn. Ah, I'm gonna turn off the YouTube audio. But up, but up, and we're gonna turn on the game audio. Wow. All right. Do 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 do. All right. Uh, thank you. I'm off to the city tomorrow for a couple hours uh, to take my mind off a few things. That sounds nice. I hope you have a wonderful trip to the city. Uh, thank you as well. It's as good as can be before traveling. Oh, you're traveling uh, far. I hope you have a good, a, a safe trip. I was about to say, I hope you have a good travel. <laughs> I hope you, I, I hope you a merry travel. <laughs> All right, chat. Um, let's. Let's go, we're gonna start a new game because it's been a while since we played the demo and I just want to get it all uh, done together. Would you like the dialogue to auto advance? No. Let's see. Thank you and yes, but shouldn't be gone for too long. Well, I hope you have a safe trip. Hope you have fun. I don't know if it's for business or uh, pleasure, but I just hope you have fun either way. Even business trips can be fun. Oh, thank you for the hydrates, Lipna! Thank you, thank you! Sadly, business? Man. Yeah, even if it's business, it'll still- it will still be fun. You took your friends in one day? Yes! Hello, Sir Mars! I figured since, uh, we're celebrating my anniversary, I would do more stream time than usual today. <laughs> Okay, so I think we're gonna do detective mode because we're real detectives here, right chat? Oh, wait, 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 I need my detective hat. I need- I need my de detective hat. Where is it? Where is my detective hat? No, not that one. Where is my detective hat? I need- I need to... Alright. All right, there we go, chat. We're ready to, de to uh, detect. With a game title like that, I have to see it. <laughs> oh, wait, wait, wait. Do I have a- I don't have a magnifying glass, do I, chat? Am I about to have to go look for a magnifying glass? You think the hat's enough, or should we get a magnifying glass? I don't have a magnifying glass. Now we're sleuthing in style. You're right. I need a magnifying glass. Magnifying glass. Uh, images. Tools, color, transparent. Let's see. What's a good one? What's a good magnifying glass? Mm, 
Du, 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 du. Maybe. Oh. That one. Absolutely that one. Alright. Open image. Save image. We're getting we're getting us a uh, a cute little magnifying glass real quick chat. I don't want it to be a web file. Okay, is it actually a PNG? Don't you just hate that chat? Did your browser ever change things to web files instead of PNGs? I hate when it does that. It's so annoying. Oh, thank you, hug. Alright, let's see if I can use it. Open folder. Alright, go to items. A realistic magnifying glass. Alright. Starts with an R. No! It didn't pop up. It didn't pop up. Heck. Alright. Do, do, do. No. I just want to download this this PNG, please. All right. Hopefully this time it'll work. Do, do, go to items. One moment, chat. Oh, wait. I'm just goofing everything up. Okay, I should be able to get it now. I swear, if it doesn't work this time. That's really big. Okay, wait, how do I turn it? Is there a way to oh oh no oh no ah, made it so tiny. There we go, chat. Perfect. Perfect. Uh, I think you just rename a webp. See that's what I thought, but it still didn't work. It didn't work. Let's see, there we go. The people, uh, yeah, incognito box, exactly. Okay, so we need to pop one of the criminals, wait, what? <laughs> oh, we need our detective issues, Smith and Lesson. Oh no, I got mine taken away. They said I wasn't ready. They said, they said the criminals weren't ready for me to have a gun yet. But we were gonna do uh, detective mode because we're real detectives here. A real detective here. Right, Chad? Life wasn't easy. No, it wasn't. Really wasn't. I was a freshly divorced duck. Not able to pay next month's rent. You guys hear it, okay? <laughs> Bro, what? <laughs> Not that I had paid for it this month yet. Oh, I'm gonna move a little bit so you guys can see better. There we go. That should be better. Oh, wait. Uh. There we go. My brain felt foggy. And I was trying to remember. The voice acting, I love it. Oh, yes. I love it so much, too. I love the dialogue in this game. It's so amazing. Where did all my money go? I had to retrace last night's steps. Deductions. 
Deductions are a vital part of a detective's work. Find clue, uh, find clue words by questioning persons and inspecting your surroundings. Enter clue words into the blank spaces to solve deductions. Gamba? Gamba? What's Gamba? <laughs> Nest egg. Uh, okay. Rent. Wait. Blank, uh, detective spent his, her last money on blank for blank. Oh, gambling! Weather and just came out. Oh, I see. No messages. I won't be needing this badge anymore. No, not our police badge. I guess I can keep it as a souvenir. My new job as the duck detective isn't going any better, though. <sighs> Well, if things keep going badly, I can always sell it online. I feel like that would be illegal. Selling a issued police badge. This fresh smell. Oh, sweet spongy loaf. Oh, you keep me safe at night. I feel like I need to make that specific uh, voice clip like a redeem <laughs> I feel like I need to make that that voice clip a redeem <laughs> I took that photo of her in a secluded hello it's too welcome in I hope you have a wonderful day we spoke for hours under the stars that night and now she doesn't even answer my texts did he steal it? I don't know. I can't believe Anna actually filed the divorce papers. Alright, chat. I need to be right back. Uh, I'm gonna leave you guys to listen to the jazzy music, and then we'll get right back to it. Just one minute, chat. Sorry about that.
Sorry about that chat, I am back. Sorry, sorry. Hopefully you guys, uh... Uh... Hopefully it didn't take too long for you guys. Uh... Blank spent his or her last money on rent, on bread, or duck. It's been 87 uh, years. Uh, I'm sorry. Old. So last night we got drunk and brought, brought, bought bread with the last of our money. But the toast helps me to forget. The toast helps me to forget. Who's calling me? Stop calling me. Oh, God. Anna! Anna! Come back! I'm a different duck now. I'm different. I've changed. Please take me back. I, it's been days. I haven't had bread in days. I haven't had a, a slice of bread in weeks. <laughs> you have to believe me! Please, Anna, take me back. <clears throat> oh, um, oh, um, hello. Oh. Oh. The, yeah, if you're speaking to the duck detective. <laughs> no, Anna, close back. Let's discuss this in person. Now. Be there in an hour. Yeah, no, no. Did you know you can't take the pond out of the duck? This man is a I professional. I spent more than half of my remaining cash on the bus fare. No, why is bus fare so expensive? And here I was, in front of their bus office, some sort of. Rundown coal center. I better crack this case, or I won't even have enough money to make it back home. Let's go quack the case, chat. New bus route starting in August. Visit the scenic mountains of South Sitia. South Sitia. I'd always tell Anna we'd go there one day. Oh. All right, I'm gonna show my mouse just in case I need to point at anything. Wow. I'm staying here until I get my money back. Bear bus? <laughs> More like scam bus. <laughs> you uh, sound unhappy. You bet I am. Also, chat is the audio okay? Can you hear everything okay? Is it? Quiet, loud. Their stupid buzzes always arrive late. I came back from a work trip to the west and arrived here at three in the morning. And they don't even want to give me a refund. How much did you pay? Hmm, two schmark. <gasps> but that's not the point. It's about the principle. Mm hmm. Yeah. Okay. Sure. Sure. Sure it is. Let's go inside. Ducks are named after Sir Jeffrey Duck, who oh, invented. Uh, I think that said the duck toy. I, I don't can know. already tell based on her face that the receptionist was a tough one. She wouldn't make life easy for me, but I had to make my way into the office. I'm the duck detective. I'm here to investigate a case. Okay. Okay. Do you work here? Uh, no. Well, then I can't let you in. But I've been hired by someone from Bearbus. Who hired you? Um, I didn't catch their name. Uh oh. Uh, should have asked. Listen, buddy. You better get out of here, or I'll have to call security. There's always more to people than you might think. I should take a closer look and figure out what she's about. All right. Ah, oh, I don't mean to be spilling all your trash. I'm sorry. 
Use magnifying glass to find clues and press E to uncover them. See chat, I knew we needed a magnifying glass. Time to socially hack her. Yup, exactly. Oh, there's a smiley face. Happy. Okay, happy. What? Giraffe. Cute. Why does it look lo so scrunkly out? Like, far away, but then up close, it's like, it, it doesn't look scrunkly. Nothing else? The sat? Okay. Seventh. Today. Alright, that's uh, all Tomorrow we got. Tomorrow is Friday. Need to remember to collect my dry cleaning. Bro, you're broke. I hope you prepaid for that dry cleaning. I swear to God, if someone steals my mug again, I'll end them. Mug stolen. Suggestion. It's Sophie's birthday next Thursday. Just saying. So keep your clothes if you can't pay? I imagine so. <laughs> what do you mean? Just call the employer back. We must uh, detective our way out of this. True, true, true. Laura from CS is way too loud. I can hear her keyboard all the way to my desk. Well, that, that doesn't say anything. Like, how far away is your desk? From, from hers. Alright, there's something else we're missing here. Ah, Sophie, the name. These are quite mundane. I'm surprised nobody wrote something more scandalous. Alright, I'm just... It says server room. It's locked. It's locked. No. Stay out. Angry face. Oh, I'm so sorry. Let's see. I know every time I've done dry cleaning, they make you pay first, so I steal a couple of emery, emery boards? What are emery boards? I've never heard of those. Uh, I really trying to do the employer's name. Listen. Tear. Sad. Oh, she's sad! Name tag. Last name. Win... Win... Win timer. Keychain. Boy band. K-pop band. Ah, yes. The log logical, uh... Logical deductions. I should be able to deduce her name now. You're still here? Okay. I'll leave you alone. Listen here, I know you're depressed, so the inner will bully you. Oh, wait, uh. Okay. What? What? Wait, 10 out of 11? Sophie? I think that's Sophie. Okay, there we go. Sophie is feeling sad because uh, nobody remembered her birthday. Hello, Venom Dragon. Welcome and welcome in. Uh, We're having a good day. That's why she's making such a face. Logical deductions. Those popsicle sticks that help you file your nails and reports. Oh, I didn't know that's what they were called. I see, I see. I should try and cheer her up. Let's tell her happy birthday. You're still here? Good observation, Sophie Windheimer. <laughs> Why did we say it like that? <laughs> Get out. Aren't I... you impressed I deduced your name? I'm wearing a name tag, nitwit. Well, it doesn't say your first name, though. That part is creepy, but I'm choosing to ignore it. <laughs> You're still here? Happy birthday. I'm just here to... Wish you a happy birthday. <gasps> How did you know? Just another one of Duck Detective's great deductions. Deductions. Huh? 
Huh? Uh, anyway, that was really nice of you. She's... She's creeped out by the fact that we guessed her first name. But she's happy that we guessed her birthday and isn't creeped out. No one else remembered. Can you believe it? If oh my goodness. If you know my birthday, you must have a connection to someone here. Uh, you would hope so. <laughs> you, you would hope so. <laughs> Here's the key card to the office. But knowing your name, no, no, we have no connection to the business. But oh, if we know your birthday, yeah, okay. Okay, yeah, okay. Office key card. Get. I'm sorry I trashed your waiting room. Ducks are 70% more likely to solve crimes. The stained carpets and peeling wallpaper exuded a stench of stale coffee and abandoned dreams. I knew I couldn't stay long or it would rub off on me. Oh, this is the last straw! Fredersen needs to be fired! Fredersen. It's quite a name. Oh, heck, it's the funky song! Let's go! I'll see what I can do. Who are you? Do you have a problem? Yeah, we got a problem. If you have one, just call our damn hotline. I'm Eugene McQuacklin, the duck detective. McQuacklin. A client hired me to investigate a case. <sighs> Why didn't you just say so? It's time we put an end to the awful lunch death. All we need to fire him is some evidence for the upper management. I'll be in my office. First, I had to find out who works here and what their jobs are. I needed to find my client as well. Yeah, it's gonna be hard when we never pick their names, so we don't know who hired us. We don't even know if they work here. Thankfully, I remembered the piece of paper I had in my jacket from taking notes during the call. Client note. Blank the giraffe. Sophie the giraffe works as a um, receptionist. The bear is blank and he is the blank. The cat works in blank and the crocodile called blank works in the blank. All right, that's a lot of blanks. It's a list of all the bus drivers. The most busy driver out of all four seems to be Petrovich. Petrovich. I feel like there needs to be an H at the end of that name, but I could be wrong. Station Hollandaise. Station Escargot. Station Sal Salsicha. Salsicha. Station Brazil. These are interesting names. Their buses don't go very far. Okay. Uh. Ah. Uh, uh, what is this? Um. Receipt expensive West currency. Salami, high quality. Where's the third one? Ah, spotless, good condition. That's a lot of salami. That's a lot of salami. Thick glasses, strong prescription, bad eyesight. Well, you never bring a salami to, a salami to snack on a work? Oh. Velcro shoes? Lame! Oh my good. Duck detective, what the heck? J just calling this guy out. What the heck? It's just like, oh, you have Velcro shoes? Lame. Like, bro, duck. That's how you get fired. Laura. Custom mug. What the heck? I'm the 
only one here in the operating office. Can you imagine? I plan all the bus routes and make sure the buses are on time. <laughs> Isn't that so cool? Don't you have an angry customer shouting outside about the buses being late? I, uh... Really? Hmm, no. Okay. That's the for later, I think. On this side look unused. Okay. Oh, ah, uh, yeah, why not? Let's just... There we go. Oh, Servoise! Thank you so much for the, the Prime sub! Thank you, thank you, I appreciate it! Thank you so much! I'm starting to see why Anna left? Oh my goodness. This she answers is a call. How can I help you? Ugh, this is the third time you're calling. I'm telling you, your ex-wife did not cancel your booking! She, uh, looks busy. Energy drink. Bad hat. Oh, bad habits. Calling us out, chat. Strained eyes. Insomniac. Oh, I don't think that's always what that means, but sure. Different brand. Own headset. Dedicated. Sure. I guess. I guess that's what that could mean. The PC is on. But the person who works at this desk seems to be on a break. They only have a single person answering the hotline right now? That's surprising. Whitlock. Profile picture. Posing. Password hint. Me in sexy alien. What? Can I what? Password accessible. Oh my goodness. I wonder if there are clues to her password. I don't think I have enough information to crack it yet. Come in. What's going on? I shouldn't go outside yet. Oh, I need such to find cute out emotes. Oh, thank you. I remember to write down their professions and my deductions. All right, let's look at this real quick. Blank tired because blank was blank by bum bum bum. Tofi works as a uh bum. I think the crocodile works in the operating office. Cat works in the bear is okay there we go kitchen oh wait what's this we haven't looked at this yet uh -huh. oh that's cute employee of the month freddy sucks first name freddy rufus sadrus insert photo here fixed <laughs> fixed layout lazy Rufus, first name. Cedarus, last name. Stop with the post-its. So there's someone here named Rufus Cedarus. I'm not sure I feel particularly appreciated. Come in. Uh, we're gonna go in the kitchen first. In here must be the crime scene. First, I want to find out who... It will okay. make things easy. I'll need to remember to write everything... All right, I guess we have to go in here. Contrary, contrary to popular belief, no, most ducks something something blah blah blah. The dimly I didn't get a read room it. seemed to promise well kept secrets and rumors. Welcome back, Gamabado. Hope you're having a good day. He's so dapper. What a fancy nameplate! It says Ernst. Ernst. Her Ernst. What a fat it said. Uh, it's I'm a just letter gonna... for an application for a promotion to senior customer service agent. Signed by L. Ernst. 
L angst. What are you doing with my family's portrait? I'm just looking Sorry. at it. I am perusing. Framed high quality. Oh, heck. Thank you for the sunglasses. Uh, oh, you're the game duck too? What the heck? Uh, this company is more robust document information control policy. It really does. What is this? Hinge. Secret compartment. Oh. Happy. Kids. Identical age. Twins. Is it normal to have a huge painting of your family in your office? Number one dad. Maybe that's why you don't have a number one dad, uh, mug detective. It's a letter for an app signed. Oh, stain, baby food, family man. Tie, expensive, branch manager. Angry brow, stern. How are the detective things going, Mr. Detective? It's Mr. McQuacklin. Right. Apologies. Um, are you planning on staying in my office much longer? Yes. I'll have to inspect the entire premise to do my job correctly. <sighs> well, hurry up. Okay, wait, how do I... Uh... Ernst. Do, do, do. Yeah, I don't know any of these people. Hello, good fellow. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope we're having a wonderful day. Where is this? Wait, no. I w uh? R. Was it you who called me? No. I never heard of you before. Oh, That's okay. unusual. It's good you're here, since there has been some unrest. Uh, okay. Well. Ducks are the first species to abolish the monarchy. Oh, okay. <gasps> There's a quack button chat. I found... I accidentally found the quack button. I shouldn't go out. I need to find out. Did I remember to write down their... Alright, what are you doing, chat? Oh, how are you, Mr. I can't go back on my word that... Oh, the most trendy duck hairstyle is a mullet? Oh, I didn't get to read why. Darn. Where do we... This is Bear Bus. Uh, your yarn ball is still on the bus. Which route were you on? I need to ask you some questions. No, I'm sorry. You can't take your 12 trombones on the bus. What? Can't you see I'm talking to a customer? It's company policy. Nothing I can do. Goodbye. Oh, okay. Do you know anything about who called me here? I love the quack button. Same. Listen, I have a million more emails to answer, and there are 50 people in the phone queue. I have worked 10 days in a row, including three night shifts, and Manfred still doesn't want to give me a raise! Just leave me a piece! So... Oh, angry. What is your relationship with Sophie Windheimer? Excuse me for a second. Oh man, I don't know how I'd survive the office without her. 
sucks that she's at the reception. I would have loved to have her in the office. I'm back. Yes, please collect your toddler from the bus station. Please collect your toddler from the bus station. Yeah, she needs a hug jet. And some PTO. Alright. Question you. Do you have any idea who picked me to investigate? <laughs> no idea, but I'm so happy you're here. Why are those letters shaking? I have a copy of your book. The early bird catches the criminal. Oh my goodness. Can you sign it? Sure. I... Yeah. I guess so. Woo! <laughs> Woo! Thanks so much, Mr. Duck Detective. I won't ever forget this. This will become a core memory. <sighs> All right. All right. Uh, I guess let's go talk to Sophie. Ducks share 95% of their genetic makeup. Wait, wait, wait. Share 95% of their genetic makeup with what? I didn't get to finish it. Uh. <laughs> the the, the one time that loading screens go too fast, I don't get to read all the duck facts. Dang it. Duck Detective hates his fans. Duck Detective hates his life right now. So, do you have an idea who would have hired me? It's about the incident, isn't it? Oh, the incident, huh? Um, sorry. No idea. Well... I think that's Manfred. Um, the incident. Hello, Degree. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Is that Rufus? Sad or no, not Rufus. Uh, Freddy? Frederson? Freddy Frederson. Laura. Nope. Pet. Nope. Eggs? Oh, oh, that's right. L. Eggs. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, we got all these names right here. Sophie the giraffe works as a receptionist. The bear is Manfred, and he is the branch manager. Uh, Laura the cat works in customer service. And the crocodile called Freddy works in the operating office. All right, there we go. Now that I had worked out these names, I was ready to check out the crime scene. Um, tricky deductions might require new perspectives. Press H to get additional guidance at any time. Okay. Let's see where that lunch got stolen from. Then I could finally talk to my client. Okay. There's an average of five ducks per mile squared. Or meter squared? M squared? What if we're in the wrong building? Oh my Cold goodness. Cold air ruffled my feathers. And I wondered what kind of sorry soul was standing all alone in the rain. Well proportioned nose handsome. All right. Bordery first name Boris. What? Hands in pockets. Back. What? It is raining outside, Duck Detective. Hey man, this isn't the bus stop. You'll have to walk south to the central bus station. What? I'm not here to take a bus. I'm investigating a case here at Bear Bus. Oh, uh, do you mean the lunch that got stolen? Exactly. Do you know who called me? Nah, too busy minding my own business. Oh, the smart guy here. I don't talk much with the customer service folks. What do you think of Sophie Windheimer? 
<sighs> Man, I wish she'd let me talk to her. What streaming again already? Yes, I figured since it was my anniversary, I I'd stream extra tonight. Welcome back, Amiga. Do you um like Freddy Frederson? He's a pretty funny dude. Loves to rant about detective novels. Okay, what is this? Someone left their bag here. Oh my god, thank you so much for the 20 stream watch streak! Ah, uh, this is that duck detective game? Yes, it is! Duck detective and the secret salami. Ugh. It's full of dirty chim clothes. Oh. oh, thank you for the hydrate as well. It's been really fun so far. Right, we're gonna... Oh, is there nothing over here? Okay. 20 stream streak, heck yeah. I guess there's nothing here. Oh, let's go back inside while I uh, grab a water. Let's go in the kitchen. Didn't think it was going to be cardboard I cut out. Kitchen, the comforting waft of cheap white toast entered my nostrils. No detective! You can quit your addiction. You need to get Anna back. No, don't fall for it. <sighs> I knew I had to stay strong. Stay strong, Dr. Detective. This wasn't what I was here for. <laughs> get out of the kitchen. <laughs> Stop eating the icing. Can't you wait a couple hours? Margaret, if it wasn't for these pants almost bursting, I'd have this for breakfast every day. Yes, yes. And you can have it and so much more later when we're done preparing. Why does a bus station ha or what is like a yeah, a bus station? Is it a bus station? A um corporate bus bus um building have like a whole full size kitchen in it. Is that normal chat? Do build it? Do uh, office buildings usually come with like a full size kitchen like this? You know, with like a stove and an oven. I want to say no, but so yes, if anyone wants to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube, right there on there. All my links to chat and the rest are in my card. No idea. Maybe the company supplies lunch for their staff. Maybe. Yes, dear. I'm Eugene McQuacklin, detective, and I need to ask some questions. A detective? How exciting! What's the most gruesome murder you've seen? How many dead bodies have you encountered? Five little pigs. No one died, but I investigated a case once where five little pigs robbed a bank, caught them red-handed, and got myself an article in the Goose Times. They called it the piggy bank case. The piggy bank case. Oh my goodness. Hello, Whoopi. Welcome in. Welcome in. Why are those your first questions? That's actually pretty common, honestly. Did someone get shot? What? No. Beaten up? Uh, no. Hmm. Surely you must have some interesting stories. Teething turtles? I almost died that one time. I got myself into trouble with the Teething Turtles Mafia. Okay, I didn't expect it to be a Mafia. That incident taught me to stay away from beautiful ladies in red. Like, disturbingly eager? Oh, yeah. Did they break your kneecaps? <gasps> Did they break your kneecaps? Huh? No! <laughs> you can see that I can walk just fine. Hmm. I don't know about that. I mean, my goodness, lady, right? Whisk, baker, motherly. All right. Ten line, divorced. Oh. Impeccable hair, well groomed. This sheep, I think, is bloodthirsty. Yeah, apparently, baking makes you motherly. Hmm. 
<laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Chat, you don't try to scare me. <laughs> I see something in the corner of my eye. And it's you know <laughs> crawling on my floor trying to scare me. Fuck. <laughs> oh my goodness. Dishwasher's broken. Can you pull again. it off? No. <laughs> We just stared at each other for like a solid few seconds. <laughs> this wash is broken again. What's wrong with these youngsters? Don't know how to treat things with respect. Why would they put the mugs in face up? Why would they put the mugs in face up? What? I mean like regular the regular way like how you drink from a coffee mug they're putting them in the dishwasher like that what the heck that's that's kind of weird oh uh, i'll tell i'll tell them you guys said that <laughs> Not the cops, it's anarchy in this office. Yup. Oh, toolbox. Jan okay, just because you have a toolbox doesn't make you a janitor. This is why we got fired. Hello, William. Welcome in, welcome in. I'm grabbing a good day. Sticker, sci fi fan. What? Uh, uh that doesn't that. Uh. Worker shoes, practical person. Mmm. I don't know about all that, but... I'm a private detective, and I'm here to investigate a case. I love that zooming on people's faces gives out more detail than drawing, yeah. Is that so? I need to find my client. Do you know who it could be? Uh, Freddy's a bit of a weird one, so I'd imagine he would call detective. Personally, I feel we're doing just fine. I don't need no messing about a business around here. Do you know anything about this bag? Why are you going around pushing bags into people's faces? It's a good question. Ugh, what's that awful smell? It's, uh, dirty gym clothes. Do you get along with Manfred Ernst? He's a stubborn one. I do respect that. Would okay. you say you enjoy Freddy Frederson's, uh, company? Huh. Huh. If anyone needs to learn to respect their elders, it's that moron. All right. I think we did everything for him. Gross. I doubt they washed their hands after leaving that greasy handprint. Margaret. First name, Margaret. I think Margaret's the sheep. Thanks for the food. Ah, salami bandit. Sharp claws. R.S. Note, thief, salami bandit. So, this must be the crime scene. This note is curious. Hmm. <laughs> no, okay. Oh, we already did her. Uh, let's ask you're questions. The only one here who could have hired Hello, Brew. Welcome in. Welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Hmm, to be honest, everyone was quite shocked by the launch theft. No one told me they've called a detective! I don't know what's going on at all! Alright. What do you think of Sophie Windheimer? She doesn't have the easiest life, you know. Oh? She just had a terrible breakup with her ex. Aww. But don't tell anyone! Can you tell me anything about Laura Angst? Oh, she's such a hard-working girl. She is for real, for real, shot. I heard she secretly studies for her online bachelor's during work. Oh. You need to keep this a secret, though. 
Do you know whose bag this is? Isn't that... Freddy's? It's all coming together, chat. Can you tell me more about Freddy Fredderson? Let me put you on hold while I find the route for you. Freddy? Freddy? He gets paid more than me. Can you imagine that? What an incompetent waste of office space. Hello, this is Laura again. I checked the bus routes and found that. What do you think about Manfred Ernst? Oh, he's a great guy. I just wish I'd finally get a raise. Aww. Yes, sorry. This is Bear Bus. Your bus will be three hours late. <sighs> what a psycho duck detective was right about him. Oh, he was lame? What do you know about Manfred Ernst? Somebody poisoned the water hole. I think he likes me. He's the only one who doesn't shout at me. Is this your bag? Huh? Mm -hmm. No, mine's over there. The one with all the salami? <laughs> yeah. Why do you need so much salami? That's not mine. It was just there. It was just there? That sounds suspicious. A really nice surprise. That sounds like it's not your salami. Uh, lunch was stolen by a co-worker known as Blank. Uh, Margaret... Oh, wait. This is Margaret... Willock? Uh, Rufus, Cedarus, and Boris Petrovic. Alright, we got everyone chat, let's go! Fill out all the suspects' names. Uh, Margaret the sheep works in... Oh, none of those. Penguin is... Rufus, and he works as the janitor. Boris the buffalo is a bus driver. Yeah, none, of, none of those fit Margaret. So we're missing some stuff. Ducks in a row achieved, alright. Yudo says, uh, it's not me he can't sneak up on, it's the dogs. <laughs> okay, we're gonna go back in here and we're gonna question this guy about anything else that we can. Oh, there are no ducks on the moon, alright. Let's see how he feels about these people. About Boris Petrovich. He's uh, not the most reliable worker. <laughs> Hi, Hudo. Yeah, but it's difficult finding replacements nowadays. What is Rufus Sedaris like? Oh, Sedaris, that's how you say it. Yeah, not the greatest janitor, but he came with the building. He came with the building? Okay, that's kind of What do you know weird. about Laura Angst? Oh, she's a fantastic employee. She basically does the work of five people. I'll sink up one of the stream, no! What are you do- Sorry! <laughs> no! <laughs> I'm gonna face my door now. <laughs> This game is great. Yeah, it's pretty good so far. <laughs> that won't help. Oh, you're gonna use one of those poppers, aren't you? If you use one of those poppers, you have to clean it up. <laughs> you know, the two of us are from the older generation. Which means we understand each other well. He is quite harsh towards the younger ones, though. <laughs> Oh, 
What is your relationship with Margaret Whitlock? Ah, oh, she's a true sweetheart. We have our weekly Mahjong evenings. Oh, they play Mahjong together, okay. Oh, I doubt they wash their hands. Hmm. Oh, we forgot the bulletin board. Halloween party. Oh, that was, was cancelled. Looking for editor, unpaid. Hungry? Get your own lunch. Angry note, a hungry. Cancelled party. Budget cuts, okay. Office parties are a bad idea anyway. They stopped doing them at the precinct after the uh, jam incident. Jam incident? Mm hmm. Okay, let's see. Uh, someone hired the doctor to because their lunch is stolen by a co-worker. Uh... Known as the Salami Bandit? I don't know who hired us. I don't know who hired us, Jen. See. Detective work isn't easy. Ponder details. The thing that bothered me in particular was... Client. To find out who hired me for the job, I had to pay attention to the crime scene in the kitchen. Are there any connections I can make to the people in the office? I need to also consider that not all identities are clear yet. That's something I will have to work out later. Hmm. Yeah, we need to figure out. Uh, ba -ba -ba, Margaret's job title. I guess let's go. Ducks can breathe underwater for up to 72 hours? What the heck? Uh, let's go talk to Sophie? What can you tell me about Laura Angst? Laura needs to chill out. I do love her, but if she keeps living like this, She'll have a heart attack by 23. What kind of a person is Boris Petrovich? Ugh, I don't know what I saw in him. I mean, I oh. guess he's good looking, but my God, is he boring. How okay. are you getting on with Margaret Whitlock? She's sweet and all, but... 23 is pretty old for a cat, though, so not bad. Sure, sure, sure. She can't keep her mouth shut. It seems like the office knows more about my personal life than me. Well, that's all for that. Uh... Still don't have Margaret's job title. Every duck has a unique footprint. Interesting. What can you tell me about Margaret Whitlock? She gets really angry with me when I don't return mugs to the kitchen. Makes sense. Um, why don't you just return them? I do! Uh, just not every day. <laughs> do you get along with Boris Petrovich? He's a chill guy. I take the bus sometimes to go to bouldering conventions, and then we get to chat. Okay. Let's go talk to Boris really quick, I guess. Oh, if I go inside, I have to face Sophie. What do you know about Rufus Sedaris? I don't think he likes me very much, to be honest. But then, doesn't feel like he likes anyone at this office. Except for Margaret, I guess. Oh. Do you think they have a thing going on? I don't. I don't work here. <laughs> I thought you were a detective. <laughs> Do you know anything about this bag? Oh, it's really strange. Things in it disappeared. What? And others appeared. Very suspicious. <sighs> hmm. What are you even talking about? Is this your bag? No. Bye. Hi, what are you 
Hmm. How long have we been here? Huh? How long have we been here? Uh... About three minutes. Hmm. <laughs> oh, everyone here is being really unhelpful. So you have no clue then? No. I... I kinda know. <laughs> I saw your shadow! I did! Hmm. Hero's being silly tonight, chat. Freaking shadow. Hmm. <laughs> so what did you see? I saw your shadow! Whenever you stepped up, I did. stood up, I saw your shadow on my wall. Yeah, I can see that. Mm -hmm. So. There's such a thing as peripheral vision. Not for you. Yes. <laughs> I have snuck up on you while you were looking at me before. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> Seeds shenanigans with it, yeah. Apparently, Hiro is gonna get one of those uh, party poppers and try to scare me. You keep saying try as if I didn't sit behind you without your fucking knowledge for five minutes. <laughs> but you didn't scare me though. <laughs> because that rude. Then why are you trying to do it in the first place? You find a nice way. Uh, hmm. Any suggestions, chat? Gasp the F word. What? That's what chat said. The F word. You said the F word. I didn't say that. I don't think I said the F word. Who said the F word? <laughs> Wait, what F word? <laughs> There's a lot of F words. I approve. <laughs> he approves of what? Oh, the party popper thing? Oh. Thought I heard Hiro say the F word? Maybe. I say it frequently, but not when I'm near her shit. Def said the frick word. <laughs> uh, they're saying you definitely said the frick word. <laughs> say it to my fucking face. <laughs> Man, now, now we got two F words. Oh. <laughs> Thank you, though. <laughs> yeah, chat, there, there's Hudo. His very rare appearances. My poor baby ears. <laughs> you scared my chat. <laughs> they said Griffin and Yabai, you know. <laughs> I learned I learned this on stream. Nice. <laughs> What does that word mean? It means unsay so. It means, uh, 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 lewd. Lewd. You're lewd. Where the heck? Absolutely salacious. Brash, maybe not lewd? Mmm. Okay, let's see. We're missing something around here. <laughs> Just ban scandalous Hudo, more like Ludo. <laughs> All right, I'm going back to work. No! <laughs> Goodness. Goodness gracious. 
<laughs> We're missing something, chat. We're missing something. We don't have her job. Lugo is my cue to leave. <laughs> Let's see... How do we get into his safe? Do we... We talk to her about all that stuff. Better watch it, chat. He don't bully you. I also don't know where the party poppers are. They're where you last put them. I, I can um, show you if you like. Not a bully. Mm. I can't leave now. Oh. I need to solve the case. Well, that rules out talking to that person outside, okay? It says it's locked. I wouldn't say you're a bully, but I would say you. Bully? <laughs> uh, you bully whenever. Uh, you were trying to be, um, friendly and, and show care. You bully your friends. Camaraderie, that's the word. Where is this stinking last word at? Okay, we got all that. We talked to Boris, right? We got all that... Did you know there are over a thousand ducks? Oh, wow. Did you just call me a tsundere? Uh... No? Hey, man. This girl has to walk south to... What? I'm not here no, to take No, we don't a... need the bus. Chad is Hudo a tsundere. Hey. Oh wait, maybe we can log onto the... No wait, we can't log onto the computer. Darn. Uh... Where the heck is this? The PC is on. They only have a single... That's surprising. I just did a quick Google search just to be sure Yabai typically means something is bad, but it can mean a lot of different things depending on the context. Or on the context. Uh. Hyuto's not bad. Margaret's customer service! What the heck? Now I thought she I was like a cook. And job, it would be easier to figure out what was going on. We had the answer all along, chat. I see you in there! Stop it! <laughs> Sundra is someone who acts standoff, secretly loves companionship. Yeah, that's not who- that's not you know. He is, uh, I think about to, um, <laughs> send a drone in here to come and bug me. <laughs> Wait, who hired us? Market? I have no idea! Also, welcome back, Jake! I hope we're going well. Uh, let's see. Uh, who hired us? That's where I'm stuck. That's where I'm stuck. Two or fewer things wrong. Okay. Um. Oh no, wait, wait, wait. Boris hired us because their lunch was stolen by a co-worker oh, known as the Salami. It's gotta be the Salami Bandit, right? Okay, uh. Hints available by closing your journal. Griffin never swears. Oh, that's funny. Griffin never swears. <laughs> Good joke. <laughs> and then comes in Hiro saying toilet words. Detective work isn't easy. The thing that bothered me in particular was... Uh, client. To find out who hired me for the job, I had to pay attention to the crime scene in the kitchen. Are there <laughs> any connections I can make to the people in the office? She speaks like a sailor to me. Don't run abuse soup when the cameras are off. So no chat. I need to also consider that not all identities are clear yet. 
gosh, I guess chat doesn't remember when I had uh, a swear redeem. That's something I will have to work out later. Two or fewer things are wrong. Laura hired us? So it was Laura who called the me. Back. I needed to discuss the case with her. Oh, You're my client? Well, why didn't you tell me? Can I put you on hold for a second? Ugh, what? Well, you should have told me. You're the duck detective. Quack was tied with the stamp. GG. What are you? I'm a duck. I'm wearing a trench coat. So, is Freddy getting fired or what? Oh, wait. Laura hates Freddy so much that she stole the salami and put it in Freddy's space. But the duck was the duck detective, what? Right? I'm uh, working on She's it. trying to get him fired because she's jealous that he makes more money than her and he doesn't have to do as much work. Ugh. It can't be that hard. Sorry, I'm back. Yes, let me walk you through the booking process. That's my guess, It Jack. was time that I found out what happened with the lunch theft. And what they were planning in the kitchen. Jones' position, to be fair. She worked really hard. Okay, uh... Um... Margaret is planning a... Surprise... Birthday... Party... For... Sophie. Boom, Margaret I finished that and I didn't even have to take a step. Birthday party for Sophie. I see. <laughs> he didn't actually forget her birthday. Oh. <laughs> Wait, how does she know how much he makes? It's a worker <laughs> violation? I don't know. <laughs> Alright, um. What do we do now? The culprit. Blank is being blank by blank because blank picked up the blank blank. Wrong bag. Okay. Uh, Freddy is being framed by Laura because... Perhaps they have an open office so it's okay to discuss pay. Perhaps they have an okay boss. Mm. I don't know. Their boss seems pretty stern. Because Freddy picked up the wrong bag. Okay, the be okay. Maybe he's being framed, but not by Laura. Framed by Boris. Stern does not equal bad. True. He picked up the. Uh... Hmm. Hmm. Seems like an awful lot of guessing going on here. Uh, I mean... It's educated guessing. So, obviously, someone... Someone is being framed by someone else because I assume that same person picked up the wrong bag. And I feel like Laura has it out for Freddy. I feel like Laura has it out for Freddy. And, uh, it seemed like Boris's lunch got stolen. I don't know. Uh, so, Freddy... Maybe... No? Okay. Ah, uh, thank you so much for the hydrate! Freddy, no. Good friend of booking the try and true point-and-click strategy of trying everything with everything. Yep. Wait, what was that thing about the mug in the notes? Uh, this, I think these are all the words that we can use for this. Nope. It is definitely bag. In the notes at the, at the entrance there were some notes. Someone was mad about a mug. Oh yeah, probably. Um, we heard something about, uh, Freddy not returning his mugs. 
to the kitchen. That might be it. I have to go here. Okay. I swear to God, if someone steals my mug again, I'll end them. That's what it was. Uh, the, I assume that's from Laura. I'm just assuming that's from Laura because Laura's mug is currently being held by Freddy. Okay. Oh, we have... We have something to do with Sophie. Freddy took the wrong mug. Okay. I'm Hello. so bored. I don't understand why such a small office needs a reception. I'm just here to keep the angry customers out. Alright. Um. What? 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 The only one that fits here is framed. It's locked, okay. The mug instead of bag? No, we tried that. It it went to three wrong things. So we know we have the bag correct. Uh, that's interesting. If we go to like mug. Oh, earlier it did three things were wrong. But this isn't right either. Uh, da, 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 da. Hmm? Ah! Ah. It was as I thought. We did it. Freddy Frederson was actually being framed. <laughs> this office wasn't as boring as it looked. When Freddy took the bus back and he went to pick up his luggage, he must have picked up the wrong bag. This happened because there was another bag that's identical to his. The bag that he picked up belonged to... The Salami Bandit! <gasps> this made him a target. And to get rid of Freddy, the Salami Bandit decided to frame him. Everyone! It's time for... You Know What! Okay, get into position. I just texted her, so she should be here in a... Huh? What's this? Surprise! Oh, uh, surprise! Uh, no way. This is all for me? Oh, heck. Huh? <gasps> Letter. Uh. Oh. Salami? What a terrible present. No, you silly idiot! The real present got stolen and switched for <gasps> salami! It's the salami bandit! I saw an awful lot of high grade salami in Fredrickson's bag. I look up so. Come in, welcome in. Hmm. Ara ara. What's the salami bandit? They struck again. And now there's no question who the perpetrator is. I've been telling you all along we can't trust Fredrickson. By the end of the day, he'll be fired. Mark my words. Hmm. 
So suspicious. Oh, I thought the salami bandit stole the salami. I thought so too. Why is he called the salami bandit then? Seems like a bit of an overreaction to a present being stolen. Or is there more to Is there more to it? Alright. Sophia received the following presents from her colleagues. Blank gave a plushie book necklace. Blank got stolen. Okay. <laughs> It'll be okay. You have the duck detective here to figure everything out. Right. Uh -huh. What can you possibly do? Leave me alone. Someone gifted Sophie a plushie. I like how the Duck Detective's deduction was like the one from Dang and Rampa. Oh, yeah. It says. I, I liked it too. Edition. <gasps> limited edition. It's a heart shaped necklace. That's probably from Boris. <laughs> Looks tacky. This is from. Cheap Girl. Page. Okay, long book. Sexy Aliens Want My Number by Suffer Cerides. Author's name. Questionable title Adult Novel. Oh, adult novel. Uh, do you plan on playing any more Baladins? Oh, uh, maybe. Uh, what do you ask, so? What did I just read? What did I just read, indeed? Talami. Salami Bandit. Edgelords. Cocky Attitude. Buongiorno. Uh, everyone. Quite unbelievable. I entered the office really easily. Lol. Sayonara, Edgelords. Something that you shouldn't have read in public, that's for sure. Something that she shouldn't have received in public, that's for sure. I uh, just curious, I enjoyed the Baladin stream. Oh, really? I wonder I'll what the keep that in mind that in case we is. finish this game early. Wonder what the purpose of that letter is. Okay. Birthday letter get. Can we get her all that? Do you think she liked my present? I mean, now she's crying, but I think I saw a sparkle in her eyes when she opened mine. Which I one was yours? Really get back to work. Hello, Jimbo. Welcome and welcome in. Thank you so much. Can you tell me something about this I letter? appreciate it. Sophie won't even talk to me about it. I don't know what to do. That's not nice at all. Who messes with someone's birthday? Okay. Got everything there. All right. I'm gonna say that Margaret gave a book, Boris gave the necklace, I don't know who gave the plushie? Oh, I was expecting someone here to say if only sexy aliens wanted my body, oh my goodness. Oh my goodness, in my say so chat? What the heck? Uh, hmm. Freddy gave a plushie? Bag, books. Oh, three things must be wrong? Oh my goodness. Yeah, I, I guess we have to go talk to people some more. Ducks can breathe underwater for up to 72 hours. So... What happens to the cake now? What do you think about this letter? Hmm. Hmm. People don't know how to write letters by hand anymore. What's with the weird line breaks? Weird line breaks? Wait. Let's go look over here. This folder says manual for CS agents. How and when to create vouchers correctly? I'm falling asleep just reading the title. 
Now what's this? Line break, secret hidden message? Ooh, maybe. Sophie. Blank return, but they're sexy now. OMG, is he serious? What a dumb pen name. Just his name backwards. Oh. Pen name, mystery author. Okay. Sophie. Chat. Friends. Okay. Message complainer. Can the, uh, oh, oh, please clean their desk. I can smell it under here. Or I can, I can smell it until here? I think she meant over here. You definitely don't want to be Laura's enemy. All right, so let's see. Laura gave the book. Laura gave the book. I think Boris gave the necklace. But I don't know. Password hint me in sexy aliens? Uh... I'm gonna save that one. Let's go talk to Freddy. He, his salami is still there. So it's not the same salami. Uh, they, they really think I've done it! Talk Detective, you have to help me! You, you, you know it wasn't me, right? Bag. Did you not think it was strange that your bag was full of salami? Uh, I don't know. I thought someone gave me a salami surprise. I'll eat salami sandwiches for breakfast, lunch, and dinner from now on. Heck yeah. I mean, I'd be pretty happy if I got spray salami. I don't know if I'd eat breakfast, lunch, and dinner with it, but... These sexy aliens seem to be a critical part of the case. Uh, for some reason, yes. Customs procedures for passengers entering from the west border. Customs import. Allowed goods. Personal items worth less than 500 shamark. Notify local police about suspicious activities. Prohibited goods. Weapons. Gun. Scary. Ten, more than 10 trombones. Okay, so chat, you can... If you have less than 10 trombones, you can put them on a bus. Meat. Potatoes. Oh, meat. Plants. Books not in the interests of the eastern states. Potatoes. Luggage will be checked at the bus station. For more info, visit Brazil. What do they have against potatoes? <sighs> Maybe it was too romantic. Did Sophie ask about me? No. Um, she didn't. No potatoes, heck this. Ah, I see. Maybe I should have gotten her something more expensive. He got the necklace. <sighs> Life's just not going so well right now. <sighs> Tell me about it. I lost all my hockey bets too. Alright. I think we're good out here. Get out of this rain. It is prohibited. Please tell me this is about smuggling salami. Uh, something about that, yeah. Someone's smuggling salami somewhere. I'm guessing you're ready to present legal evidence of Frederson's misconducts. It wasn't Frederson. Everything is pointing towards him. I will Thank present you the so. culprit soon enough. Both Gamba addicts? Yep. Well, I don't really well, care you. how long it takes you. This will Frederson's last day. Oh. He's the salami bandit chat. Do you know anything about this letter? Well, it's obviously a cheap prank by Frederson. Only he would find this funny. So Boris gave a necklace. Laura gave a book, I assume. Um... Plushie. So maybe Margaret got a plushie? I 
I don't know. I don't know, chat. Oh, the business? Oh, I didn't see this. Blank or being blank, blank from blank. Oh, that that's that's very helpful. Legally uh, imported from Brazil. Um, salamis are being legally. It's not stolen. Something from. Legally framed. It's not Brezel. Brezel said that it uh, did not take meat. Legally? We only have uh, legally. We only have the word legally. We need to find illegally. Maybe the word's here somewhere. There are an average of five ducks per M square. All right, patient. Office, uh, there's something in the office. It's, yeah, it said meat wasn't allowed. Uh, are there any other words? I think there's the computer. Okay. Oh. Excuse me. You need to read the fanfic to find out who the sheep lady is? Yeah. Uh, let's see. Captain Brightbeak stared deep into the alien's eyes. There were 12 of them. They were red. The eyes. Not the aliens. The aliens were blue. There were 43. Wait. But it just said there were 12 of them. Uh, the, the aliens were blue. Um, and there were 43. All of them wore shiny metal armor, which shined like something shiny made of curved metal. Uh, the lead alien stepped forward. Captain Brightbeak could tell it was the lead alien because it was the one which stepped forward. It was also the most beautiful, the only one with purple eyes made a noise that sounded a bit like talking from a hole that looked a bit like a pretty lady's mouth. The translation device the captain had invented word into action, translating the words into words he could understand. Hey, you look cute, a mechanical voice whispered in his ear. Can I get your number? <laughs> oh my goodness. All right. 43 naked and blue aliens at a rim. What the heck? <laughs> this might be the worst fiction I've ever read. Someone needs to read more. <laughs> Oh my goodness, so... Purple-eyed alien. Okay. I cracked it. Let's see what you secret she it. has on her computer. She's the purple-eyed alien chunk. Cutie. Delete everything. What? Deleting data. Illegal activity? Accomplice. Vacation. Planned trip. You look cute. Can I get your number and stuff like that? Oh, lines like those? It vouchers for CS agents. Three hour delay compensation booked on next bus. All right. West VPN secret cake recipe. Never gonna give you up, dot web. All right, game. All right. All right. I, I see you. Hearts, lovers. Yo, Rickroll! <laughs> the detective doesn't know how to minimize windows. Tragic. Yeah. Who is this person she's messaging? All right. Uh. Oh wait, 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 wait. There was an actual vouchers booked on next bus through the lake. Oh, darn. Uh, 
Uh, let's see. Margaret received a romantic message that contained a something. Oh, something, something. Uh. Okay, I don't know. I don't know that one. Uh, business. Illegally imp- Oh wait, Celicia. That explains all the high-grade salami. I just needed to find out who was behind this. Romantic message that contained a romantic message checks out. Listen, you- we all read that book, chat. We all read that sexy alien book. It- it seems about right. We got the business. Salami's are being illegally imported from Salsicia. Sophie received the following presents from her colleagues. I believe Laura gave her the book? Or maybe Boris gave the book. And then... No, wait, not Boris. Um, Rufus. Yes, Rufus gave the book. I hope it was read to me by Griffin unwillingly. Mm, sounds suspicious. Plushies, nothing, necklace, letters, cake. The cake didn't get stolen, right? Bag? No. Books? No. Letters got stolen? Letters? I wanna say nothing got stolen, I don't know. But something here is wrong. The message. That is Margaret's computer. So, Margaret. That's from Margaret. Maybe. Rufus received a scary. A scary salami? The salami was a decoy? Oh my goodness. I don't know. I don't know. Message that contained a... Blank... Blank. Received a... Uh... Letter... Marker received a scary letter that contained a scary message. Silly? Okay, I don't know. We we need uh Detective work this. isn't easy. The scary the thing salami. That bothered me in particular was message. This doesn't look like a straightforward message. I wonder if there is a hidden meaning. I need to analyze it and inspect every single letter. Uh all Detective right. work isn't easy. The thing that bothered me in particular was the presents. best way to figure out who gave what present should be to just talk to everyone. Haven't I seen a plushie like that before? Also, there's something funny about the author's name in that book. I should look at it again and check if there are clues about it in the office about the stolen present. Once I mm. figure out the intention of the letter, it should all be clear. All right. We're gonna do our best chat. All right, the weird spacing. Let's see. Bonjour now, everyone. Quite unbelievable. I uh, entered the office really easily. Uh, Sayonara Edgelords. There's a B and an E. That's underlined. B E. B E. That's that's one word. Hmm. 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 
I see the message? I don't see the message. I don't see it. Do, do, do. I don't see it. I don't see it either. Let's see. I also picked up the book author before the hand. I feel good about that one. Oh, yeah. So... chat let's go talk to everyone again collect our thoughts I totally forgot about Sophie's birthday B is that initial something I I don't think so. Yeah. The only B name is Boris, but he doesn't have an E last name. Hello, Kibo. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. Fan of all that high school drama. People just cry over everything these days. All right. Yes, if anyone wants to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check out my YouTube, or my throne, there are my links in chat, and the rest are all on my card. What did you get her, Laura? I mean, now she's crying, but I think I saw a sparkle in her eyes when she opened mine. I should really get back to work. Laura gave her a plushie. So, nothing got stolen after all. It seemed that the salami present was intentional. Okay. Not nice at all. Who messes with someone's back? Now we just have the message. Sparkle in her eye, the only gift that made her not look bored out of her mind was the salami. True. Uh. Laura receipt. Wait. Oh, is you getting EP? I'm always EP. I'm stuck on this one, chat. Do we have all the words? I believe we do, yes. We have 14 words. Can you pull up the letter thing? Letter thing? Oh, the, uh... This? The birthday letter? Stash really makes the look. Oh, well, thank you. Thank you, thank you. Yeah, I don't... I don't get it. Asking for friends AP is like asking the Incredible Hulk if he's angry. Uh, okay, so... Laura? Laura? No, wait. Sophie. It seems like a silly letter. Where are the other words? Uh, silly letter. Oh! 
Sophie was receiving threats. We got it. <laughs> we had part of it right. I needed to find out why. The mystery of the Salami Bandit was slowly getting unraveled. Western goods I don't know are what prohibited was. from entering and being sold in the East. <laughs> this is why the Salami Bandit decided to make a business out of buying high-grade salami in the West. Smuggling it to the East. And selling it at a high profit. Also, for some reason, Sophie received a letter from the Salami Bandit. You never saw a scary a message? The first letter of each message. word? Oh! This was serious. I had to question all of the employees. Thanks for coming, everyone. Well, everyone except for Sophie. Where is she? Slacking off, playing on her computer phone like usual. She's having problems with her family. She was at her desk and said she needed a moment. <clears throat> I will start then regardless. I have made my deductions and drawn some serious conclusions. <gasps> Finally! Is Freddy getting fired then? Who is the murderer? I... What? The, no one died! I'm getting framed! I'm telling you! What a load of baloney. He... is... right, actually. He is getting framed. Cool, what? Why would anyone bother? Ah, that is the question, isn't it? Why would anyone bother? Get to the point. It's through my observations that I uncovered a conspiracy. Rupert is also quite possibly a horn grin. <gasps> this is ridiculous. Why are we still listening to a random duck that waddled into this office? I'm leaving. First one to leave is uh, the culprit. I'm a certified private investigator and... It's okay. Just tell us what you know. <sighs> Salami is being smuggled from Salsitia using your very own buses. <gasps> huh? What's going on? Okay, this is going too far. I really have more important things to do. Now that is really scandalous. Does that mean we're losing our jobs? Not even supporting his fellow worker. <laughs> Listen, everybody! It's really important that no one leaves the premises. <sighs> I need to get back to work. Oh, everybody's leaving? All right. Oh. I'm still here, Mr. Duck Detective. Mm, yeah. Hmm, <laughs> yeah. No one got any cake! Oh wait, what's this? Phone? Someone forgot their phone. Eat the phone home? KTS enjoyer. KTS band. Are your parents still angry at you? Angry fight? Huh? Oh, Message nonsensical. Nonsensical. Mr. Penguins, welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a good day. This is curious. Why would she write like this? BTS. Yep. It almost makes Freddy the suspicious one. After all, criminal always returns to the scene of the crime. Hmm. It's a heart-shaped necklace. Huh. This is getting intense, isn't it? Maybe you could need a little help? You seem lonely. Hey, now. I could be your assistant. I don't need an assistant. What do you want me to do? D uh, decipher messages? Talk someone into telling us the truth? F 
follow people around. I'm pretty good at that. Freddy? You're now my number one suspect. Just stay here. Like this? Yep, you're doing great. You stay right in there. Ducks are the only birds that can fly backwards. Oh, who would hire me at this age? Oh, maybe I can be a, a real estate agent. You go, Margaret. I always wanted to be a rich real estate agent. Why would Laura recruit you to deal with a theft? Aren't there any other detectives who are actually qualified for the job? I've been doing very well so far. If I do say so myself, the truth will be revealed in the end. Huh? All right, let's see. I'd be pointing my finger at the one that has the uh, financial motive. True. Oh, he's not in here, chat. Manfred is out of his office. Time to see what's behind his precious family portrait. Why are there things knocked off his desk? Oh, hello, Vagan. Welcome in, welcome in. Oh, I put my foot down and found a dog. Wasn't expecting that. <laughs> Wasn't expecting a very furry carpet. <laughs> the S00BD. Oh. Um. Uh, mm. TS double O B D. I don't know what that is. I'm sure chat knows. Chat's smart like that. Ducks were the first species to abolish the monarchy. Whoa. CS double O B D. No. Oh wait! Freddy's computer. Crime and thriller. Murder at the Beaver's Dam. Kidnap and a kingpin. Detective novel, kidnapping. Detective novel, murder. Post. 10,000? Why do we have 10,000 posts, chat? Eugene McCracklin looking for a job will do almost anything. Buy my book. Throw bread to the fine beak of Lady Justice. Eugene McQuacklin. Oh wait, we have a we have a blue sky chat. We have a blue sky. <laughs> Social media account stalking. Someone is clearly obsessed with detectives. Duck detect needs to go outside more often. <laughs> okay, wait. Uh, map. Parking lot, kitchen, boss is off. Oh yeah, right. Right, the the thing. The thing with the stuff in the thing. She left? Just like this? <laughs> Maybe she's at home. Should I look for her? Okay. That's it, I quit. Quit job, sudden news, okay. You'll never see me again. Never dramatic, okay. Uh, Sophie Windheimer. Oh, why is she using the little squiggly? Like was on the the uh. That same squiggly was on the 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 the, 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 the salami. The salami bandits. Uh, no. Hmm. What a dramatic turn. I should keep this as evidence. The threatening message, yes. The tilde, yes. Sophie left, and she left a note on the desk. I'm gonna go check out her computer. A I T A for expecting my coworkers to remember my birthday. It's my twenty. Oh, she's on Reddit chat. Hey, pull that letter up again, the one you just read. Oh, one moment. We'll, we're gonna do this and then I'll go back to it. Uh, it's my 20th birthday today and no one congratulated me. I don't need much, but at least a handwritten card would have been nice. Birthday card, high expectations. Unknown number. Blank anymore, I'll tell them everything. Don't. 
Bite. Okay. You blocked this number. Click here to unblock. Blocked. No communication. All right. I can't believe she complained about this online. Oh, there's a phone right there. Let's go back to the letter. All right. That's it. I quit. You'll never see me again. Sophie Weinheimer. What about it? A single current grass would have been nice. High expectations. That's harsh, Dr. Man. True, true. All right, we're looking at the letter. What are we, what are we looking for? What are we looking for, chat? I want to make sure that one didn't have a secret message too. I'm not that I am seeing. Okay, the letters don't mean anything. All right. Let's see. The last dialed number on this phone is oh. zero three. We've zero seen this number. One seven seven seven. We've seen this number somewhere. I don't remember where, but I remember the seven seven seven. Let the last dial. Oh. Wait. This is the note Sophie left. Can you tell me more about it? It doesn't make sense at all that she'd just suddenly leave. She definitely needs the money. And she mm. would have told me. She needs the money, huh? I'm her friend. Did you read Sophie's letter? I did. Something's off. Something's. Different. Something's different. Okay. What do you think of this note? It's no surprise she's left, is it? Would you want to work with someone you've dated in the past? Okay, let's go out here. Every duck has a unique footprint. Oh, you're right about the tilde. She didn't write the note. We already checked that. Okay. It's not really a detective's job to spin crazy conspiracy theories, is it? Sometimes the truth is pretty crazy. Seems a bit cheap. Have you seen Sophie's resignation? <laughs> uh, no. That sounds suspicious. I can't say it comes at a surprise. She never particularly enjoyed her job. It's difficult finding replacements nowadays, though. Hmm, that sounds suspicious, Joe. Right, and then I think Freddy is in the parking lot out front. You're a bit cheap, man, Freddy. Yep. Laura deserves the pay. Oh, ducks sleep with one eye open. Something, something, something. I can't leave now. I need to solve. How do I talk to Freddy then? Oh no, wait, he's in the kitchen. All right, oops. He's in the kitchen. I thought he was in the parking lot. All right, go to the kitchen. And we need to figure out the uh, ba, 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 the safe in the boss's room. What do you think of Sophie's resignation? Oh, huh? I guess Boris was overdoing it a bit with that present. I did tell him to cool off a bit. Why are people not listening to me? You suck, Freddy. Contrary to popular belief, most ducks don't file their taxes. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Who would have guessed? Oh, okay. We're missing a lot of words here. He overdid it alright with that book of his. The, uh... D-S-O-O-B-D. Alright. I feel like we have this. Hmm. 
thought the book was from Laura. Did he give the jewelry? Okay, so Laura, the cat, gave Sophie the plushie. Um, Rufus, the penguin, gave her his book under his fake pen name. And then Boris, uh, Sophie's ex, gave her the quote-unquote tacky heart necklace. Let's see... CS agents. It said C-S-O-O-B-D? Right? So... But I think those are all numbers on the save, so that... Mm, something doesn't fit right there. Ah, oh, I see the, the thing now. I see it now. I feel like KTS Enjoyer is Sophie's phone. I think that's Sophie's phone. All we have left is uh, the office. Let's check here again. It's a letter for an application for a prom signed. No. What a friend it says. No, all right. Uh, hmm. <laughs> okay, so the numbers only go from one to nine. CS00 BD. Oh. Detective work isn't easy. The thing that bothered me in particular was. The safe. That note on the safe had pairs of letters on it. I wonder if they're abbreviations for something. Haven't I seen them before? I should also look at previous deductions. Numbers? But what could they mean in terms of numbers? What can I count here? Did I see any numbers around the office? So... CS, that might be Laura? That might be Laura's? We saw a sticky note on her desk that's just talking about CS. Oh, oh, that could mean... Freddy's area? And then BD? Um... That could either mean birthday or branch director. So, something in maybe Laura's? Laura's or Margaret's and then Freddy and then the boss. Oh, thank you for the hydrate mega. Thank you, thank you. Alright, let's go look around chat. See if we see any numbers. Oh, apparently, um, ducks were named after someone duck who invented ducks in 1672. Not seeing any numbers, chat. Not seeing any numbers. Detective work isn't easy. The thing that bothered me. Missing clues. There are still hidden things or areas I haven't accessed yet. Did someone in invented ducks? That's what that loading screen said. One is Manfred's secret com and also this additionally, I sh Okay, so let's go look in the server room. If it's unlocked, that is. It says so it's locked. It's still locked, okay.
Need two more numbers, John. We see any numbers anywhere, chat? Miss Folder says manual for CS agents. How and when to create vouchers correctly? I'm falling asleep just reading the. Should have known ducks are real before someone made them. Yep. They're too cool to be, uh, nature made. stuck here chat <laughs> let's see so i assume that the uh bd is a one for the number one dad mug on his desk but i'm not seeing the other two Blank, blank, blank to make him or her stay quiet about blank, 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 blank. Blank is the one that provides the blank to blank. All right. Um. To make stay quiet about illegally importing. Salamis. Hello, Snowy! Good to see you. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Let's get a shout out for my big sis. Thank you so much. Hope you're having a good day. Let's see, Blank is the one that provides the salami to Blank. Lurking a bit, but that I'd wish you all. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, also, thank you so much. Thank you, little sister. You're adorable. Ah, no, you. No, you. Chat, go follow my big sister right now. She's cute. Uh, blank up blank because blank wanted a blank. Uh, Sophie got kidnapped because. Wanted to leave. Go home? Cry? Ah. Uh. Uh. This is perfect right here. This this is we we just want to go home. I thought it would be this, chat. What the heck? We're missing some words. I guess let's go talk to everyone again. Why would Laura recruit you? Aren't there any other... I've been... The truth. Huh? Hmm. Alright. We've got everything there. Maybe I should... It can't be that hard. Got everything there. Go to the front. Does this mean? Uh... Got everything with him. Sophie's parents are awful, you know. I wonder if that's what made her run away. Everything there, all right. Hmm. Ah, uh, welcome in, Piku. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Also, thank you so much. I appreciate it. 
folding a duck more than seven oh something about folding a duck more than seven times. Darn. I wish I could read these. Are you writing another No. I can be your ghostwriter. <sighs> I'll think. Okay, it's nothing there. Uh let's go to the parking lot. I think that's the last person we have to talk to is in the parking lot. Look what you've instigated. Now everyone is dilly-dallying around instead of doing their work. Was that different before? Yeah, we talked to everyone, chat. What are we missing? Chat, I need your brain cells. We need we need to pool our brain cells together and figure this out. Hello, Ben. Welcome in, welcome in. Hope you're having a wonderful day. Part 240, I'm trying to date the hat. Griffin, may I date the hat? I have no idea what you're talking about. What? Been alright? Good to hear! Hmm. 3.10 p.m. Um. No watching your Digimon VODs on YouTube. Oh, thank you so much. I appreciate it. Thank, thank you. Also, thank you so much for the follow. Was the phone on the floor of the reception area? Do, 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 do. Let's go check. It was something that said the last number dialed. That's all it said. Let's. Last dialed number on this phone is zero three zero five one seven seven seven. Wait, did you add something to make YouTube comments show on Twitch? No. Uh, let's see. Let's see. I've seen that number somewhere. Let's see if it's in our notes anywhere. Wait. Was that the number that called us at the beginning chat? The 777 number? Oh wait, or, or. No, it's not that. Oh, maybe it was on that. Uh, it's a list of the most. Where did I see that number? Pretty sure that phone number is a date of birth, is it? Ah! There it is! There it is! I know I saw it! So they called the police! The local police! It's for more like a specific day of the year? Yeah, it is. So that, that'd be quite a year. 1777? I don't know what year we're in, but... The fact that you can't take potatoes on the bus, it might as well be 1777. Hmm... Uh, do you always multi-stream or is it due to anniversary? No, I always multi-stream. Let's see... Where are the numbers, chat? What do they mean? But yeah, I've been multi-streaming for uh, a few months now. Ever since Twitch allowed um, multi-streaming. See, I think the one comes from here, but I might be wrong. It's a letter for an app signed by... But... Go so see us, so... Customer service, and then operating something, whatever Freddy's job is, and then branch director. So I think that's a one. I release Twitch, so I see you live on YouTube again. I might come here again. All right, Piku. Thank you so much. I do appreciate it. Uh, you can use this or or YouTube. Either is fine. Whichever one is um, easier for you. 
Let's see, so more than 10 trombones, so it's okay as long as you move less than 10. Yep. Who's the number of people in each department? Ooh. Huh? Nope. Darn. There's because there's two in customer support, one uh Freddy, and then one director. Uh right. Chat, I'm dying inside. Do you guys have any, uh, ideas? I feel like we're close, maybe we aren't accounting for someone? Well, here's everyone, chat. We have Sophie, we have Freddy, Laura, Margaret, Rufus, Manfred, and Boris. Boris is the bus driver. Manfred's the branch manager. Rufus is the janitor. Margaret is oh, customer support. Laura is also customer support. Freddy is uh, operating something. And Sophie is the receptionist. I talked to all of them except Sophie because Sophie is missing. Margaret might be my favorite. Yeah, Mar to me, Margaret's the most relatable. We're missing four words here and two words here. This is just how crazy she is. So, three CS, two ops, and one BD. Wait, three and two? Oh. Well, oh, thank you for that, Andre! If you drop, drop a duck, it will always land pointing yours. I don't know about that one. No, we're missing a word. We're missing two words here and four words here. Uh, I assume I have most of this one correct. Hmm. But I tested, but I'm sadly with no ducks. Yeah, I'm also duckless. West VPN WXE Secret Cake Recipes 21. So Margaret has a number three on her desk, or on her computer. Maybe we could use that? Never kidnap a king penguin kingpin on his birthday. He doesn't really have anything on his computer. Oh, right here. Seven? Let's say seven? I don't know. Is there Mega Mind meme? No ducks? <laughs> I'm, I'm glad that, that someone understood where I was going with that. <laughs> I think the next blank is Salami Bandit also? Maybe, yeah, that's what I thought. Not sure. Nope! Ah. Detective work isn't easy. The thing that bothered me in particular was... I need to inspect the reception thoroughly. I have a feeling the phone on the... F to figure out what happened to Sophie, I need to consider the current time and when the last time was that anyone has heard of her. Okay. Current time. There's a clock right here. It's a uh, three ten. Look at reception again, chat. Nope. All is good there. 
Let the last dialed number on this phone is zero. Okay. Two eleven. Hmm. Said I quit, you'll never see me again, Sophie Winmeyer. Alright. We're stuck chat. Should I look and we can't get into the server room for some reason. It says it's locked. It's locked. That phone last called the police. There are no ducks on the moon, okay. The two desks on this side look unused. Oh, two, maybe? Two? And before the key is in the safe, probably. We're just gonna... We're just gonna try to guess the number, maybe? Something two, one? But it didn't tell what the codes correspond to. C S O B D. I, it corresponds to the jobs. There's customer support. There's uh, operating something. I I forget the proper term. Uh, and then branch director. I think I get it, chat. It's gonna be really dumb. I'm gonna try to find... Look for the acronyms and the words should have already. Most of them was on a cork board and the others on a computer screen. Um... One last tip, the number refers to people. chat i see we're getting it wrong all right chat was completely right there's people missing from our suspect list technically there are two people that work in customer support there is one person that works in operations this is not branch director chat this is bus driver they both have BD. We were told earlier on... There are four bus drivers. I did it! Can't believe it. Can't believe it. New receptionists also considered part of customer support. No, they're secret party. Yeah, they just... Oh, I always Griffin's wanted smart. to open a ridiculously no. big safe. Griffin googled it. Griffin googled it. <laughs> Let's see what secrets we were he so has close. Here. We were so close, chat. Oh, you don't tell us. I'm gonna be honest. That's just that's just me. Two job titles with the same abbreviations. Yep. 
And uh, the bus driver one only got mentioned at the beginning when we first got here. Dear Ingrid, I know I haven't been there for you and the kids recently, but things are looking up. I would love to take you to a romantic getaway. To Holland Days, love, Manfred. Two letters, different handwriting. Blank demands, blank employee of the month. TV in my room, keep quiet about the thing, do all these things, and nothing will happen to you. Blackmail enemy, oh. Uh, da -da 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 Keep quiet, fear of snitching. All right. Awful lot of security for a branch manager of a bus company. Wait, this keychain. Did I? Maybe it's a branch manager, Chad. Maybe I got the words mixed up. Here it is. The Here it key is. For the server room. Let's go. Get to the server room. All right. I like that we can spin the chair whenever we walk by it. <laughs> Server room, let's go! Alright, chat, we need to get a duck. We need to get a few ducks, and we need to test the theory of if they always land pointing north. Let's see what's hidden in here. Uh, what are you doing? Hello, Zio Poser! Welcome in, welcome in! Hope you're having a good day! Uh, oh my goodness, that duck is so cute, it is! Like how the trash cans remain toppled? Same. Uh, secret detective business. Hmm. I'm just gonna walk. Oh. The electrical sparks and blinking lights created a claustrophobic atmosphere. Shouldn't someone clean the trash? They're probably waiting for me to leave because I was the one that, that bumped them up. Uh them off. I definitely felt that I wasn't supposed to be here. All right. Sophie got kidnapped because Sophie wanted to snitch. Sophie got kidnapped. <gasps> there must be more to this. Is he narrating his own story? Yes. Salami Bannock came not Sophie to make him or her stay quiet about Manfred illegally importing salami. Um Huh? Huh? Three or more things are wrong, nope. Alright, that's my guess. We got it wrong. Like a true villain, I mean detective. I don't think it's meant to do this. Oh, boxes. What's he keeping in all these boxes? Box. Oh, it's us, chat! Tattered hat, poor. Oh, calling ourselves poor. Take it back. Take it back. Oh, I don't like that we have fingernails chat. Get it away from me. Breadcrumbs. Shame. Alright, chat, let's let's look at the eyes again. Eggs under eyes. Anxious. Oh. I I'd rather he stay like that. Has that been there the whole day? He's so hard on himself. <laughs> Honestly, this is nicer than my apartment. You can relate, tired Griffin. Listen, I don't go up to the mirror and be like, oh, look at that. I'm 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 so I'm so poor. I'm so tired. I'm so ashamed of myself. Easy, easy. Camera three playback, 2.45 PM. Oh. Taken Academy, Odyssey Island. Lisa, how to delete Ize's selling history. Dad, this is not Google. 
Can't believe this is almost the career path I pursued, though mostly just the forensic side of things. Oh, forensics sound cool. Bear bus, a hundred schmark voucher. Bear bus, hundred schmark voucher. Oh, Jake, thank you so much for the hundred bucks. Does this fix the poor part? Does this fix the poor part? Yes, thank you so much, Jake. I appreciate it. <laughs> Sale listing voucher. So he was selling... Whoever was in here was selling bear bus vouchers. Manipulate history, confusing message, computer illiterate. Camera, bus, CCTV. All right. What's up with these bear bus vouchers on Easy? Easy. All right, we got all the words shut. Oh, a career of being a duck, exactly. So, the Salome bandit kidnapped Sophie to make uh, her stay quiet about the Salome bandit illegally importing salamis. Uh, the Salome bandit is the one that provides the salami to the Salome bandit? I don't, I don't know. Bear Bus? Bear Bus is the one that provides it to that? I don't know, Detective chat. work isn't easy. The thing that bothered me in particular was... More business? I need to analyze the letter in Manfred's safe care. I should also see if there is a connection. I need to have a look at people's peace. To the Dutch detective, all right. Salami Bandit, leave a piece of salami at the crime scene. I don't know if it's actually a piece of salami. Well, no, uh, the Salami Bandit leaves, like, Whole things of salami at the crime scene. So, poor tired duck's gotta have his illegally imported salami. Not if I'm there first, I'll eat the evidence. Okay, rock bottom, Eugene. Can only go up from here. Who am I kidding? Alright, Lisa. Lisa. Dad. I think this is Manfred. Manfred had the keys to the server room as well. Ingrid. Ingrid is the wife. We don't know his children's names. Duck feather nails are gonna haunt my dreams tonight. Duck, oh, duck feather nails. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. His, his fingernails on his, on his feathers. Wait. Sounds like a username, Doc Feathernails. Wait, I am getting confused. I'm getting confused. The Salami Bandit kidnapped Sophie to make her stay quiet about illegally importing salamis. Or was it... Not Sophie. Uh, I don't think it's Rufus. I'm pretty sure it's not Margaret. Maybe it's not Margaret? That said dad, so it's probably a guy? I don't think it's Freddy. Probably not Boris. Uh, I think it's Manfred kidnapped Sophie to make her stay quiet about the salami bandit illegally importing salamis. Manfred is the one that provides... No? Uh... About... Illegally... Selling... The bus passes? Vouchers. Wait, what? <laughs> Manfred kidnapped Sylvie to make her stay quiet about Manfred illegally selling vouchers. Uh, Manfred's the one that provides the... vouchers to the salami bandit? Uh... No. Hmm. Detective work isn't easy. The 
thing that bothered me in particular was... I need to analyze. I should also see if there is a connection in the office. I need to have a look at people. We saw vouchers on someone's computer. I don't think it was Manfred's. We saw it on this com computer right here. It's in the server room. And I assumed that it was Manfred's. Because Manfred was the one that had the keys to the server room. for selling them another computer user is providing them okay not that one that's reddit and uh sophie talking to who we thought was the salami bandit That's uh, Laura's computer. She's on the complaints, talking about Freddy, and then talking to Sophie. This one? Is it this one? They're both internal vouchers for CS agents. This is Margaret. This is Margaret's computer. So... No, that's not right. It might be right, but we still have a lot wrong. <laughs> um... So we can say... Kidnapped Sophie. We're gonna- we can say safely that those are right. Um... Hmm? No? Three or more things are wrong, chat. What are we getting wrong, chat? So... This is Margaret's computer. This is Margaret's computer. She has the vouchers up on her screen. And then... In... Do do do... Things are wrong now, chat. All right. Rufus is the janitor. A janitor would have keys to go to other places, like a server room. Perhaps Rufus wasn't the kidnapper? Nope, that changed. It seems like Rufus is the kidnapper. Rufus kidnapped Sophie to make her stay quiet about... Margaret? No. Okay, so we got that one. We got the top three right. S stay quiet about... Uh, Ruf... Um... <laughs> Uh, so we got those Rufus kidnapped Sophie to make her stay quiet about who? Rufus? Nope. No, well, I didn't change it. But it also it this seems buggy down here. Sometimes it changes, sometimes it doesn't. Mm -hmm. 
Rufus kidnapped Sophie to make her stay quiet about... There's a lot that they could stay quiet about. Could be the salami thing. Could be the voucher thing. Hmm. Is it Rufus illegally selling vouchers? Nope. We also don't know if this is correct either. Let's see, chat. We have this right. Okay, that didn't change at all. This is either importing or selling. Do, 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 where to go? That still doesn't change. We have probably changing something in the last three. Who was it that was getting the vouchers again? Margaret had the vouchers on her computer screen. Yeah, we had two or less at one point. Um, I don't remember what it was. Uh, also, yes, if anyone's follow my Twitter, on my Discord, check out my YouTube, my thrill, and there are my links in chat, and the rest are on my card. Rufus kidnapped Sophie to make uh, her stay quiet about... Margaret? No, three or more. Um... Oh, the recipient. Oh! Three things must be wrong. It went down, chat. To Rufus. All right, chat. All right, we're getting there. We have two or, th 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 two or less things wrong. So Margaret was providing the vouchers to Rufus. Rufus was uh, illegally selling them? Yeah, he was illegally selling them. Wait, what's wrong? What is wrong? What is wrong in this? This makes sense to me. Maybe the first blank is the Salami Bandit? Nope. It's Rufus. We've already checked that one. Um... Blackmail? Sophie? Oh my goodness, alright. Maybe Rufus blackmailed Sophie. To make her stay quiet about... Rufus... Selling... Vouchers? Margaret Sloan provides... I don't see what's wrong in this chat. Buses? Buses? What about buses? Wait, Rufus blackmailed Manfred. Got it, chat. We, uh, my this brain cells is what came together. Rufus and Margaret were doing with the vouchers. My, my brain cells came together. We were stuck on Sophie for too much. We weren't paying enough attention to the letters in Manfred's safe. Manfred was the one got bla that got blackmailed. So this is what Rufus and Margaret were doing with the vouchers, okay. That might be illegal, but this wasn't what I was here for. I needed to catch the Salami Bandit. I quickly needed to find out where Sophie was being kept. I also couldn't let the Salami Bandit get away with this. 
It was finally time to find out who was behind everything. Oh. Sophie is at blanks, blank, a blank, a blank, blank. <laughs> oh, we have all the words for this shot. All right. Sophie is at... His office. On a... On a... Sophie's at the doctor's dick tip station in a cake. Sophie's in the cake. Why is she in the cake? Under. Under a box. Under a trip? Uh, on a trip? Wait. We have two things now. Okay, but first, Sophie's at... We, uh, I assume it, they're here. In wait. Oh my goodness. Is at whose office? Is she in a box? I don't know. Two or fewer things are wrong. Is that Bear Bus's office? In a cake? In a bus? She's in a bus chat. Oh my god! That's where she is being kept! It's important that I stayed calm now. I couldn't alert the culprit. Or all of this will have been for nothing. I needed to first figure out who is behind everything. So I could confront them. I thought that she was at the police station because the last number that that phone dialed was the cops. That was logical. That makes sense. But I guess she got kidnapped before the cops could arrive. Now the last one, chat. Blank is the salami bandit because blank and blank are blank blank. Oh. <sighs> What? Similar bags, yeah? Ah, uh, right, yes. <laughs> uh... This is this is the last part chat. Um who is the salami bandit? Because blank and blank uh blank and his or her blank are blank. Boss has identical twin kids, seems like it might be relevant. See when I saw identical, I was like, the kids? I don't know. I don't say anything about the kids in here. The salami bandit's the salami bandit I've cracked the case. We cracked the case chat. <laughs> Boris. 
Or is this the, sal the salami band? Or is it Freddy? Nope. Uh, Boris? Three things must be wrong. One thing in this is correct. The handwriting's identical? True. Ah, oh, you were right! Alright. Good job, Degree. Alright, let's see. Um, Boris is the salami bandit because... Huh? Yeah, they told it, but I don't... I don't... Where... Is there anywhere that we've seen it before? Salami Bandit. Because the Salami Bandit? Mm, nope. Threatening letter. <gasps> Manfred, Manfred is the salami bandit. That makes a lot of sense. Ironic that his handwritten note meant to frame Frederson ended up incriminating Manfred instead. Something was missing There's a lot of Fred here. here. Freddy Frederson, Manfred, lots of Fred. Who else was involved with this? I had collected everything I needed. I just had to organize my thoughts. Oh my goodness. Boris is a salami bandit's accomplice because salami bandit needs someone who easily easily carry the blank of the blank. Ah, uh, there we go. I meant to write that one. Wasn't working alone. It made sense for the bus driver to be involved. Bum bum bum. The dating of the lovers. <laughs> Blank is the wait. Okay, um Because they used to date Sophie. Boris is the Selmy Band's complex because they used to date Sophie. Selmy Band it needs someone who could convince Sophie into helping, no? Selling? No? What? The what? What? Accomplice, enemy, or lover? Ah. Sophie's a salami man's enemy because uh, she used to date Boris. The salami man needs someone who could convince. Convince. Oh, oh, uh. Boris and helping. Oh? Sophie's the accomplice? I believe <gasps> Sophie managed to talk Boris into this. Aha! I had it all figured out now. It was I don't. time that I confront the culprits. But first, I thought Sophie was a victim. I had to free Sophie. Wait, how is Sophie an accomplice? 
when she's oh. the kidnapped one. What? Here. Why is everyone yelling? At first, I had to organize my thoughts. Again! This looks dramatic! It's kind of a long story. And guess who deduced said long story? Thank you for the The one and only! Oh, thank you! Duck Detective! Read the room this is how everything went down give it the to a straight up the bus branch was suffering losses and had their budget cut as a result manfred worried about the financial stability of his family felt himself backed into a corner this is when he became the salami bandit <gasps> he made his grand plan of salami smuggling and realized he couldn't do this alone. He recruited Boris, since it would be easiest for the bus driver to load and unload the wares discreetly. Mm -hmm. The bus would go through a customs check at the Salsiccia bus station first. And then Boris would take a detour to get the salami and load it onto the bus. This is why the buses always had a huge delay. <gasps> It wouldn't be easy to talk Boris into crime, so Manfred convinced Sophie to join the team. Boris's obsession with her would make it easy for her to manipulate him into helping with their plan. Everything was going well until... The Duck Detective! That's me. Infiltrated the office. Freddy was meant to be the scapegoat for the crime, but I'm not fooled that easily. Sophie began getting cold feet and ultimately wanted to confess to the police. Manfred couldn't have this, so he interfered. In an outburst of panic, he abducted her and hid her in the luggage compartment of one of the buses. And this is why Manfred stole Laura's lunch! What? <gasps> Everything is figured out, but who is truly guilty? Manfred, Sophie, and Boris are all involved in the smuggling. Who should get arrested for their crimes? Manfred was the mastermind behind everything. Should Manfred get arrested? No. He was the planner, but he technically didn't get his hands We're hungry, ready. Laura, yep. Not to mention what it would do to his poor family. What about Sophie? Without her, the smuggling wouldn't have been possible. She manipulated poor Boris into taking the salami across the border. Should Sophie get arrested? No. Manfred clearly was the one who gave the Oh, <laughs> Ashley, you say no to everyone? Excuse you. <laughs> Excuse you. <laughs> Sophie was naive to follow along. I don't believe she is truly liable. Boris was at the end of the chain. Had he refused to take the salami on board, the plan would have not worked out. Should Boris get arrested? He didn't even realize what was happening. I don't think this is a basis for arresting someone. A crime was committed, so there must be someone who is accountable. I need to make up my mind. Everything is figured out, but who is truly guilty? They're all guilty. <laughs> Smuggling salami is a victimless crime. I mean business. Listen, it's not actually illegal. They're just breaking a bus law by putting salami on the bus. So I mean... They're technically not breaking any laws? Manfred, Sophie, and Boris are all involved in the smuggling. Who should get arrested for their crimes? Manfred was It's the gonna make me pick someone, isn't everything. it? Should Manfred get arrested? He is the reason this all started in the first place. Of course he should be arrested. What about Sophie? 
the border, we must be prohibited for good reason. Without her, the smuggling wouldn't have been possible. She manipulated poor Boris into taking the salami across the border. Should Sophie get arrested? What she did was clearly illegal. She needs to face the consequence. Boris was at the end of the chain. Had he refused to take the salami on board, the plan would have not worked out. Should Boris get arrested? He might have not realized what was going on entirely, but that doesn't mean he's not liable for engaging in the smuggling. All right? I've made up my mind. Bad ending. I will report to the state police. Manfred! Sophie. Boris. And I do it again! Anything to secure my family's well-being. I'm not sure grand-scale salami smuggling was necessary for that. How else was I going to cope with all the budget cuts? If anyone actually worked in this office, we wouldn't have such terrible performance in the first place! Hey! I work! Yes, and then you keep asking for promotions! How am I going to give anyone a promotion if we have people baking cakes during working hours? <laughs> And while we're at it, Rufus! How dare you embezzle money from the company and then threaten me! Everyone of the who scow? Everyone? Yup, everyone. Bad ending? Yeah, bad ending because we're, we're gonna have to tear apart families here, ruin lives because someone wanted to help people keep their jobs by uh, moving salami from one place to another. <laughs> That's... Rufus said we're only doing that until his book takes off, and then I'll play the lead alien in the movie adaptation! Look mm, who's going to jail now, Manfred. Not me, that's for sure. <sighs> I stand by what I said. I regret nothing. If I had known that calling the duck detective would result in this, I would have never done it! You were supposed to find out who stole my lunch, not accuse my best friend of smuggling! <sighs> well, David had pants. I knew this was it's a so bad angry. idea from the beginning! Why did Boris have to lose the bag? My god, he is such an idiot! I had no idea it was that important. Why didn't anyone tell me about the plan? You said your cousin was ill. And the only thing that would make her happy was the salsiccia salamis. Oh, I should have known. If you're stupid enough to believe that, then you're also too stupid to bring a couple sausages across the border. Okay, she kind of deserved well, it. You really did quack the case, Mr. Duck Detective. You're just as cool as I imagined. Boris was innocent, people sad. Not now, Fredersen. Solve the mystery. The truth. The truth is an ugly mistress. I wonder if it mattered if, if we... It is my duty to uh, only... to the fine beak of Lady Justice. If we only d decided to arrest one or all of them. Okay, so it was. It, it was an actual choice. 68% of players decided to arrest Boris. 60 63 decided to arrest Sophie. 97% decided to arrest a man, Fred. Oh my goodness. That's insane. Boris was manipulated though? Okay, see, if I had known everything that I did at the beginning, or like uh, before, I would have picked Sophie. And only Sophie. Sophie was a jerk. Manfred was just trying to provide for his family and keep his keep the business running. And Boris uh, He was just love struck. It was all Sophie. It was all Sophie. We did it, chat. 
we found out who took Laura's lunch. I mean, we really didn't. Who took Laura's lunch? <laughs> who took her lunch? Sophie was coerced to commit a crime by her boss. Uh, I don't even know about coerced. It sounds more like asked. Don't worry, we'll vouch for Boris. We'll get him dropped to community service. Yeah. We'll put all those charges on Sophie. And we'll we'll have to beg the uh, the jury for um, whatever it's called, grace, leniency, for Manfred, because he has he has two twins. He he has twins oh, at home. Oh crap! I completely forgot to collect my payment from Laura. Well, we didn't even find out who ate her lunch, so I mean, why would she pay us in the first place? Everybody already went home. How am I going to pay for the bus? <sighs> Ize? Guess I'm walking home. <gasps> Freddy! Need a ride? I don't want you knowing where I live. I'm I sorry. just booked this one. It's been such a long day after all. <sighs> oh, thank you. Come on, it'll be fun! Plus, you must be tired after all the detective work. I really don't. I really don't want you to know where I live. Please? <sighs> I... <sighs> yeah, fine. Oh, he's gonna know where we live, Great. chat. Now I finally have time to tell you all about my ideas for your social media. Please don't. I could get you tons of publicity. No. And imagine, we can team up. Absolutely not. And I could be your sidekick! Why, you know Trust the Croc? I don't know, he was sussing out our social media. I don't know, I don't know how I feel about that. Ducks share 95% of their genetic makeup with bananas. Go home, buddy. I work alone. Duck Detective? Sounds like a buddy cop sequel to me. Ooh. Continue. And thus, Crocdrome is born. Oh, wait, is this the end? It is the end. Alright. We beat the game, chat. Achievements. 86%. Wait! Where did we miss a trash can? We missed a trash can somewhere, chat. We have to find it. It's probably in here, isn't it? You can't take the pond out of the duck. Le I definitely. Where's the trash can? Where is it? We're missing a trash can somewhere that I didn't knock down. I swear. But like it's probably where Laura's left her lunches. What are you lunches. doing, snooping around, are we? That oh. room is strictly up. I even put a post. This is for him. Important. Huh. Oh. With our luck, it's probably a trash can that's like outside or something that we can't get to. over all the ones there. Let's see if there's any outside. Talks migrate thousands of miles in the winter to escape your whining. Alright, game. Let's see, that was a pretty good one. Did your office at the start have a trash can? Yes, it did, but uh, I was pretty sure that we did uh knock over that one. I don't know about outside the building, though. Wasn't there one in the server room? Did you knock that one down? I didn't see one in the server room. We just went there. Chad, did you see it anywhere? Oh, there it is! Oh, 
What? Oh, not kick off at the bear bus office. Okay. That means we're missing another one. Where is it? They run because they're, they're the cause of said whining. Where's the other trash can we're missing, chat? There it is! Party's hiding it. There we go, alright. Hundred percent. Perfect. <laughs> we found them all. There are over a thousand ducks, chat. Wow. Mission success! We did it! We 100%ed, uh, Duck Detective. Oh. Oh. Thank you, Steel Series, for clipping Duck Detective. That's a great voice work in this one. Yes, really. It really was. I, I really like the voiceovers for it. Such a fun game, heck yeah! We got three and a half hours of gameplay out of that, that was really fun. Got all seven achievements, 100% of the game, heck yeah. Um, I hope they make another one. That was really fun. It was worth the $9 that I paid for it. Let's see... But, but, oh, thank you for the iPads. Thank, thank you. Honestly, Chad, I was expecting that to go a little, um, a little longer. <laughs> uh, oh, thank you for the hydrate. We even got sneaky behind the scenes cameo today and everything. Oh, wait, what? What? <laughs> Congrats on your two years, of course. Thank you so much, uh, all of you. I, I don't know if I would still be here if, uh, it wasn't for you guys. So I appreciate it. Appreciate you guys always coming and uh, hanging out with me. Let's see, we could play more Paladins. We could play. Ooh. Ooh. I've been meaning to play this. Been meaning to play this. We might try this. Griffin out Fox that caper? Heck yeah. I'm gonna try this shot. I've been meaning to give it a try. Thanks for a full year on Twitch. Heck yeah! Heck yeah, heck yeah! Me have been streaming a long time. Running install script. What the heck? But you're already installed, game! Come on, game. Do do do. Grab a controller. Oh. Alright. I'm gonna try this demo because I've been meaning to give it a try. Do do do. And then we'll probably end after that. Come on, game. Game? Oh. Alright. Oh, okay. You guys can still hear me. All right. Do 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 do. Ah! It's another bird thing. How do I jump? Hold, don't tap. Oh, okay. English, please. down chat. I'm sorry. Alright. I think that that's good. I think. Woo! That should be good. Uh, apply. Hello, Zero! Welcome- Oh, oh, welcome in! Hope you're having a good day. Alright. 
Crows are capable. Oh, crows are capable of complex. I think that's a complex thought. Okay, the fly you hold right trigger and move is left. Oh, complex problem solving. I see. I see. Toggle map back. Pause quest log. Hello, little crow. I see you got the grips on flying already. Ready to take on the world? Huh. Before you start, something very special to give you. <gasps> yeah. These glasses have been worn by me when I was your age. My grandma before, my grandma's grandma before. They're a reminder what slick birds we are. Our sacred family heirloom treasure. Uh, treasure it well. Now go on, there's still much to learn. Talk to various animals in the village, they'll teach you all about the crowy things. If you're ever lost, just look at your quest log and map to find them. Go on and have fun. Alright. I don't know how to pause. Okay. You can track quests to make the description show up on the left side of the screen during normal play. Okay. There are multiple screens in the pause menu you can navigate between. Oh, well that's just a straight line, all right. Meow! Oh wait. Swoop! Meow! Okay. He wants us to swoop? Hola, crow. Tired of flying slowly? There's an advance from a flight called the swoop. Okay, this is a little loud. It's a little loud. Uh, every time you swoop, you gain a bit of speed. Hold down the flat button. And then press down swoop for a second or two and then release the swoop. Alright? You do not need to release flat button while swooping. Repeat this pattern to cover great distances quickly. Here, practice by flying through these ranks behind us using swoop. Okay. I'm gonna turn it down just a little bit more, chat. Is that okay? Radical. Practice this pattern and you'll move through the world much quicker. You can try restarting and try again. It's tricky, but you'll get the hang of it. Okay. Oh, we got bumped by a tree. Last turn ram into humans. There we go. So swoop can be used to move faster. It's very versatile, however. You can also use a tram into things. It can be tricky to use, uh, but practice practice makes perfect. Go on, try it now. Trooping into these three dummies. Okay. Ah. 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 Beautiful. Before you go, I'll let you know another secret. If you swoop into an object or someone carrying an object, you'll pick it up automatically. Swoop can be very versatile. Oh, and don't forget, you can adjust swoop. Uh, what are settings? Beats me. Okay. What are those? Hmm. Grabbing an object. All right. What a nice speak you got there. Did you know you can grab things with it? Oh yes, that's your main method of causing chaos and so versatile. Go on, help me out by bringing these scattered wood logs back here. All right. Bringing them where? I guess to them? Nicely done. Now remember, not all objects can be picked up, so it will be too heavy. Look at the hang of it though. Go speak to the wabbit. He'll tell you all about tools you can pick up. Okay. Oh my goodness. Hey, you look like one smart bird, eh? But you're smart enough to use tools, aren't you? Some objects you pick up have special use. Go on, grab this leaf blower and use it to blow leaves away. Oh, um...
Hmm? Oh my goodness! <laughs> Untitled the crow game. <laughs> Wait, where's the last leaf? Oh, there it is. Really are a smart bird, huh? Keep an eye out for tools around the world. They might not uh, all be useful, but they sure are fun. <laughs> What's in here? Oh my goodness. Ah, Uva slept. It's waking me up. I need to go save the world. Oh. Wah. Elfish cap. Oh, never mind. Thank you. How do I... No? Okay. Hmm. As a bird, we have a special power, one that no other creature possesses. Can you guess what it is? Wrong. You can poop down on unsuspecting humans. Go on, poop on three chipmunks walking around. Oh, and if you run out of poop, don't forget to eat some fruit. Okay. Excellent. This is the kind of chaos I want to see in the world. Let you out onto uh, another secret. Some foods are special. They'll give you extra power when you poop. Oh no. Here, try this can of beans and see what it does. Oh no. Oh no. Poop? Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Know your items. Food, a special food. Special food? Tools and quest. Shiny. Oh, hi. So, this might sound like a weird flex, but I think I can talk to animals. You can understand me, right, bird? Right, bird? You're hearing this. I'm not insane, right? Tell me I'm not insane. Tell me! I'm just gonna take this and go. Uh, welcome in, Kevin. Hope you're having a wonderful night. Photo mode? Look what a beautiful bird you are. Your beauty and grace must be captured. In photos. Go on, try it. Take a cool photo now. Don't forget to document your journey. Customize your crow. Hmm. Default? Wait, 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 wait. Oh my god, we can be a chicken! Puppet. Oh! Puppet! Scarf color. Ooh, that one looks kind of cute. There we go. Here we go. Perfect. Screenshot. Okay. Oh! Give me my key back. Land to end level. No, my key! Bedtime. Good night, Yamamoto! Hope you have a wonderful sleep. Thank you so much for hanging out. This seems like a neat game chat. Stop! Whoa. Well, well, well. If it isn't the new crow in town, eh? Yeah, yeah. Who do they think they are? 
Ooh, looks like you've got yourself sunglasses, eh? Ka, Give me those. <gasps> you ain't cool enough for sunglasses. Yeah, not cool enough. So uncool. Gotta earn your right to wear those, you dig? Maybe if you prove your worth, you'll get them back. Maybe. Kaka, Kaka, Kaka. Thanks, chick. <laughs> That'll show him. Well, well, let me explain how this goes, Kaka. There are animals all over this land who need your help. You can find them easily by checking your map. Go talk to them, learn what they need, help them, and earn crowputation. Once you hit 100 crowputation, you can move on to the next area. Each area lets you earn up to 150 crowputation, though. You don't need to help all the animals, just enough. Open the pause menu, check your progress, tasks, blah blah blah. Okay. I think this is gonna be a cute game chat. Meow. 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 I just wanted to try this. It seems there's more to the demo than what we just played, but I think that's uh, all we're gonna do for it tonight. I'll be- I'll be really excited for when this game comes out. It gives me very untitled Goose Game vibes. I've been meaning to try this demo and it's just been sitting there so I was like, why not? We just got done playing a, a bird game, why not play another bird game? Meow. 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 Alright. Alright. Ba da da. Oh, wait. Uh. There we go. One, two, end game. End game. Close game. Quit. Alright. That was fun, chat. Oh. Thank you so much, Kali! Thank you, Swing. Thank you, thank you. I really appreciate it. Let's go try to find someone to raid. Let's see. Uh. The most chill streamer by far. Oh, I appreciate it. Thank you so much. We're truly one of the comfy streamers. I've had the pleasure of finding. Stay awesome. Oh, thank you so much. Oh, you know. Welcome in. We're just ending. I hope you had a good day. We're about to try to find someone to raid. Um, maybe we'll raid bonds. Maybe let's look. Let's look at our, um... There's anyone... No, we can maybe read. Do -do -do. Thanks for stream streamer, of course! Thank you so much for coming! Do -do 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 -do. Let's see, chat. Do we want to do a retro game? Do we want to do a different retro game? Okay, do we want to do Ape Escape? Do we or do we want to do Banjo Kazooie? Or do we want to do um? Burnout Revenge. Which one? They're all retro games. And they all the streams just started, so. I like me some Ape Escape? Oh, Nero, thank you so much for the Mishima Streak. Do any more years? Like, yeah. 
We're sure one, two, or three. Okay, one is Burnout Revenge. It's a racing game, I assume. Um, there's Ape Escape. Or there is Banjo Kazooie. Ooh, Banjo. Okay, we uh, let's make a poll. Make a poll real quick. Uh, Burnout Escape. Um, Ape Escape the three. Banjo Kazooie. Okay, hurry, chat. Got a minute. Pull us up. Pull us up. Pull us up. Pull us up. Ah, uh, bum 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 bum. Bum bum Who raid? Chat. Who raid? Burnout Escape, Ape Escape Three, or Banjo Kazooie? I vote Monkey. Doesn't Ape Escape and Banjo both have monkeys? Or is the Banjo-Kazooie guy a bear? I... I can never tell. Looks like Ape Escape is winning now. He's a bear? Oh, I see, I see. Never played Banjo-Kazooie. I think I have it, though. Bears are cool, though. I could tie it up. If you tie it up, chat, I'm flipping a coin. All right, Ape Escape it is. All right. So, again, here are my social socials. Blah, blah, blah. Here are my socials. If anyone wants to follow my Twitter, join my Discord, check my YouTube, or my phone, there are only links to chat. <laughs> um, it just there's my raid message. If you don't have my emotes, feel free to use uh, any emotes that you do have. And I will see you guys on Monday for more Digimon. Alright, chat. Have a wonderful weekend. Alright, thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. Goodbye, goodbye, chat. Thank you again so much for celebrating my two years uh, of streaming. Thank you so much.